That's confuzzling me. Because I legitimately don't know where I'm supposed to go next. Except for maybe we could go down to the bottom of Ghost Town. And check that very, very, very bottom area. I don't think there's anything down there, is there? I'm pretty sure there's not. Got an enemy there. Hi, you buggers. They're only level 29. They're not that scary. I remember whenever 29 would have made me crap bricks, but we're strong enough now that we can survive them. Uh, just a second. No. There you are. It smacked the crap out of him. I was wondering why... Okay, I think it was just picking up my fan for a second there. You guys are so tough, so scary. I'm going to beat the crap out of you. There you go. Okay, so off we go to another lovely location. We're going to end up getting levels just by trying to figure out where we're supposed to go next. We probably were told. Oh, yeah, we were supposed to go after... Um, oh, what's his face? Oh, crap. The salty boy. Who was annoyed that we somehow slighted him by fighting something. I completely forgot about him. That's something I should probably focus in on. So let's see. Corpse piece, eh. Let's go ahead and finish exploring this place, and then we'll go look in on Salty Boy. So what's down here? N oh, there's a portal. Mirrors Frosted Ice. Do you touch it? Sure. Nothing happens. Oh, that's how we get to the Mausoleum of Ice. Okay. Okay, at least we know where it is. Okay, so you guys are level 37. I don't feel like fighting them. I don't feel like fighting every single little dude in here. So, Kyo. Kyo's his name. So, let's see. This is how we get out of here. At least we've revealed that entire map. We know that that's the portal to the Mausoleum of Ice. So, we don't have to worry about anything there. So, where did he want us to meet him? I actually do not remember. Ah, uh, you guys are just gonna die. And fight, skill. Uh, let's go ahead and do... Let's do a full-on high cast clock up thing. I forgot to switch it off of there, but yeah, we can do this. He's going to clock up and set them all on fire. Or she, sorry. I made the character and I'm already just like calling them by... Yeah, it, it doesn't matter. Bonk, everything's dead. Why are you evading everything now? Just super evasive. Uh, fight, defend, fight. Decent amount of experience. I do, it does seem like level does not impact the experience gain much. So let's go ahead and grab as much as we can. Pretty stone, small holy vial, and a sharp fang. Nice. We'll sell it all. So party, member. I need to switch your skills out. Because you want the overclock. And you want ch -ch 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 delay time. Could do time stop, could do a lot of things, but not right now. So Stranger Base, Stranger Guild, I forget where he was supposed to be, is the thing. It's, I have slept since then. So Stranger Guild, I guess we talked to... You were the one who told us, I think. That Medell boy is impossible to predict here, I thought he was about to... Oh, nope, that's not it. Do we actually have a note? Quest, there it is. Call from Kyo. Valley of the Ruined, why here? It's hard to understand him. You should be extra cautious. Um, where is the Valley of the Ruined? That's... Con I, I'm not sure where that is. Uh, okay, so Stranger Base. Maybe Mausoleum of Metal? Were we just like close by farming the entire time? 
metal that is mimic land that is south dark waste road buried fortress so it's not there how do I get to that ruined place I can look that up now so let's go ahead and go to dungeons Valley of Ruined. Um, slums made up of shipping containers modified by denizens. A massive cruise ship. It sits blocking the narrow valley. A rough, dark, danger. Okay, so it's in the slums. Okay, so that explains why I didn't see it. So let's go ahead and go to the slums. Uh, oh! Valley of the Ruined. Okay, so he's going to be waiting for us here. Where? I don't know. There he is. Are you going to just fight us here or something? Is this what's going to happen? Ouch, we took damage from that. That sucks. Sudden flash of lightning strikes before you. He's mad. Hey, I've been waiting for you. A surprise attack, huh? Uh, there's no cheating in combat. Cunning is a skill. I've been thinking, what is it that I'm lacking? Okay. N but not a single thing came to mind. Um, you're lacking, like, a moral compass because you are just a... Um, I hate to say it, he's almost insulty. But after that, after all, everything about me is perfect. Okay, groovy. Oh, nice look there to you, the the wild eyes. Kyo, I'm the chosen one of Sword City, me and me alone. Will Who will be the one to stand beside Ryu? Let me show you. You're going to try and murder me, eh? You're just a little bit crazy. So, of course, we're going to go ahead and Divinity Holy Light 2, just so we can just auto-heal. And we are going to beat the tar out of everything. They're level 31. So that means that they actually stand a chance. But not much of one, I don't think. Because his frontliners are weak. I don't know about him, though. So let's go ahead and do fast spell and just set up some multi-avoids. And you are going to do overclock and high cast. And actually, yeah, no... Instead of that, I'm going to have you do an enhanced magic starting out. Just boost the magic damage of everything. Clock up, fast spell, you're going to do a multi-hit. This first turn is just building up the prep. Getting everything ready to kill. If all he can do is 100 and something damage, we're fine. And slashing the wizards. Oh, that one dodged. Oh, magic potency is halved. Oh, what? Guess what we're doing? We're, we're ramping it up. Enhancing. Fight, skill, rush. Salt slash two. Another multi-avoid. Skill. Overclock. A high cast. And you're going to do a thunder blast. And you're going to do another multi-avoid. So this will put us at five multi-avoids. Oh, he's resistant. That dealt some damage, though. What is that? Oh, what is that in the back row? There's more mages? Okay, so they're just curing themselves. Wait, that's a cleric. Okay. Skill, let's go ahead and do sword chivalry or dark chivalry. Yes, because they're humans. Concentrate, assault slash two. Skill clock up. Um, you fight those. Overclock, high cast, and let's go for. Let's go for Thunderbolt, and we'll do it on you, because that should hit both the ones in the back. Fast spell, you're going to do multi hit. Just to guarantee our chance to hit. We're taking out the annoying things. Okay, so we got rid of that. Now we just have the cleric to deal with. Oh, but she did. Okay, so it's just him. 63 damage. One. What the fuck, game? That's horseshit. Let's one shot you on a boss fight. That. Mm. <sighs> Item. No, you keep fighting him. You keep fighting him. Item use. I hate using this in the middle of freaking battle, but I need you up. Skill, overclock, high cast, firebolt. 
item use. Please do not let this be a waste. If it is, I'm going to have to redo this fight. On you. Okay. And I think we restored the life point. I don't know if we're supposed to lose this or something, or... Fight, skill, rush, skill. You just fight. Clock up, fast spell. Okay, multi-cure, skill. Overclock, high cast. Actually, no. Delay time on him. Clock up, skill, fast spell. You're actually going to do high cure on him, just to get him up. And he's going to do three heals. Not for a lot, but it helps a little bit. Get your revenge. Get that rush in there. I don't know how much life he has. And let's go ahead and do another multi-cure. You do an overclock, high cast, multi-cure. And you're going to do a high cure on him as well. Oh, for God's sake. Come on, game. Oh, for fuck's sake. This is irritating as goddamn shit. I really don't know how I'm supposed to protect from that. That's stupid as hell. Am I supposed to have, have everyone go through fighter at the very beginning of the game? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Is that really what this is trying to tell me I should have fucking done? <sighs> Let's go for delay time again so everybody can actually hit the asshole. And you're going to do bio wall because it I don't know what else you're going to do. I don't think instant death is a condition, but fine. <sighs> Sky Dragon 2. Fight. Fight. And that just slows our ability to kill him down insanely. No, I don't want to defend. I want to clock up, you jackhole. Uh, let's go for delay time again. And just throw out a, another multi-avoid. I really, I don't like that. It, it's stupid. I hate instant death mechanics in games, period. Yes, it's semi-preventable, because guess what? We've got a big dude that can sort of tank it, but... Everybody else is just doomed. Well, thank you for stunning him, at least. This means uh, is not going to get any XP for this. That is asinine. Um, you have a clock up available. Fight. Skill. Delay time. Skill. Actually, no, you're not going to clock up. You are going to do another freaking bio wall. Because in the vain hope that maybe it prevents it... Oh, we got him, finally. Thank freaking God, jackass. <laughs> oh, the instant deaths are making me salty. Uh, that that could make me want to quit this game. Kyo falls to his knees and looks up at Alania. Yep, this is wrong. This is all wrong. We murdered your face. Jackass. <laughs> I'm gonna be mad at him the rest of the time. Why are you doing this, Kyo? Why are you fighting us? But Kyo ignores Ryo's words and continues talking. Uh, this is ridiculous. Why should you be the chosen? I'll lead the guild. It's mine. The guild doesn't belong to any one person. It belongs to all of us. All the strangers. Don't make me laugh. Stop acting so high and mighty. What? It's hegemony. Do you even know what that is? Organizations are simple tools. The superior lead the inferior. That's why I gave everything I had in order to lead you all. So why? Why isn't it me? Everyone sees Alanya instead. Because we're stronger than you? And we're less of a complete prick? Wait, is that why? Okay. Kyo seems to have realized something as he starts looking about. 
Okay, I see. You were all in on this. It makes sense. It was all you all. I was getting in your way. Now you're plotting to get rid of me. Am I right? Aren't I? Okay. Do we just hit him? Yeah, I, I'm not even going to be nice. Whack. <laughs> Kyo falls once more. I don't even care. He can go drop dead. I get it. I know exactly what you're up to. You bastards rot in hell for all I care. The moment I die, I'll make sure you'll regret this. Okay. <laughs> He's going to turn into a demon or something. Uh, when it fades, Kyo's nowhere to be seen. He ran away. Like the little insta-death coward he is. Kyo left behind us, never to be seen again. Fine, he can stay the hell away. And we got Secret Tech V from him. Sweet, that was totally worth it. <laughs> and then, we don't have enough to revive, auto-revive them. So we're going to have to grind that off just a little bit. What a pain. Honestly, this just sucks. I always knew Kyo had this weird sense of pride, but I never thought he'd take it this far. After Toji disappeared, Kyo took over supporting the guild, but maybe it was just the confidence of his that took him down this path. Yeah, I don't doubt it. And on top of that, you know how competitive that guy is. Looks like the pressure finally got to him and he just snapped. He's a douchey bro. Enough already. There's no point talking about this. Okay, we're not psychologists. We can talk in circles forever, but it won't change a thing. He is what he is. The fact is, Kyo betrayed the strangers, then chose to leave on his own. That's more than enough reason. He's going to join the old guy, most likely. We can't afford to worry about the past. Right now, he's our enemy. Okay, right. If he never came back... Um, like Anna said, there's no other choice but to consider him our enemy. But he... The report just says he disappeared. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Did he warp somewhere? Well, thinking logically, it's likely he was taken somewhere. If that's the case, I wonder where he is. You seem really worried about him. Um, I can't help it. Ever since I got here, he's always had my back. Well, not really. Of course, I'd feel like this. It was so awful. Helpless, even. He's trying to indenture you to himself. Yeah, he's batshit crazy. <laughs> yeah, it's horrible to lose an ally like this, but he chose his own fate. There's nothing we can do about it now. Basically, he's snapped because he can't be the one in charge. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if something took over because of his envy, but we'll make him pay for what he did. Just like Anna said, we're in the middle of a war. There's no time for mourning. We need to keep our spirits up and keep fighting. Okay. Quest complete. Call from Kyo. Yay! <sighs> ah, Lania. Hi. How are you doing? What's up, Helga? Um, I was ordered to come here, but I'm somewhat unfamiliar with this building's layout. Could you point me to the leader's room? Sure. Okay, I'm in your debt. What's up? Um, head to Medelco. I don't mind, but why exactly? I'm afraid I don't know the details. The head of the Medel family sent a notice to gather there at once. To be safe, Lady Merilith has already gone ahead. Got it. I'll head over as well. Is it f for another meeting? Question mark? Perhaps, though it is quite early to do so. Regardless, I've been instructed to escort you, Lady Ryu. I ask that you accompany me. Okay. We'll come with you as well. Um, you headed somewhere? Okay, hi. Yeah, to Metal Co. Okay, really? Okay, why are we Why are we going there? I don't just go random places without some information about what to expect. Where we were called by Alm. Uh, you're going to go without knowing why? Seems fishy. Uh, worry not. I swear upon my honor as a knight. I shall protect Lady Ryu no matter the cost. Well, we saw you in the depths over there. Cool, that's great and all, but I still think someone else should go with you. Um, you need to stay here and rest. I know you haven't fully recovered. We're gonna come with you. Yeah, we'll go. No problem. Take your time to decide. I shall escort Lady Ryu to the Metal Co. in the meantime. There shouldn't be an issue. Simply meet us when you're able. Okay, fine. She get ready to go. Yep, I need to revive somebody. And I need to grind out reviving them completely. Ah, <sighs> the deaths. If deaths weren't so penalizing in this, I wouldn't mind it nearly as much, the instant death stuff. I still don't like instant death. Instant death is just a cheap way to alter difficulty. But it's, yeah. Uh, we'll have to take out another butterfly heart. We got 15 secret techs, so let's go ahead and take out one butterfly heart. Do we take out a few secret techs, or do we just keep them? Since we already have that guy, we don't need the heart stones. So base, probably going to, yep, give us money. None of them leveled up. We do actually have... Oh, they're almost level 15. Because once they get to level 15, they'll be able to help with... Oh, never mind. We already have full recover, so revive. You. Let's see how long this actually takes. 
Treat death. Revive. Yep, one day. You come out with us. So how long does that take to recover? Ele it's taking more time to recover him now than it did last time. <laughs> Whenever we had less points into that. Come on, game. <sighs> you, you irritate me, my games. My games? We're going to have to grind him out, though, before we go to that. So let's go ahead and stop the recording here. So if you guys on YouTube enjoyed this, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. This has probably only been a couple episodes because I am going to leave a note for me to cut out some of it. Because um, we were just kind of faffing about. So I will see you guys next time. And as far as those of you on Twitch, we are continuing on. Thank you.